Drama outside a New York courthouse as the man accused in a deadly road rage attack faces a judge. We'll start there at 4 o'clock. Hello, everyone. I'm David Ushery. And I'm Natalie Pascarella. On Long Island, a man now facing murder charges in that deadly road rage beating. We're now getting our first look at the victim. This is 54-year-old David McKenzie. Today, emotions, as you saw, boiling over outside of court as the alleged attacker faced a judge for the first time. News Force Pacey Chang live in Baldwin with more Pacey. Natalie, you know, police arrested 26-year-old Patrick Destin, and they say the motive for this brutal beating was pure road rage. Destin was upset that a car, a used car that he had just purchased, was involved in a car accident with the victim, David McKenzie, and he blamed him for the accident, even though police say it wasn't the victim's fault causing him to stomp the victim repeatedly in the head, kick him until he died. I lost my son for nothing at all. It shouldn't be. Perlene McKenzie devastated and in mourning over the senseless death of her son, David. Hard-working family man. Police say David McKenzie was driving home Saturday night around 10.50. He was feet from his house when he got into a car crash with 26-year-old Patrick Destin. Police say it was Destin's fault. He had run a stop sign and made a... Um, unsafe right turn without his headlights on and struck the side of uh, Mr. McKenzie's van who was going westbound. And even though prosecutors say McKenzie told Destin he wouldn't call the police to report the accident, Destin was still irate. The subject caught up to the victim, David McKenzie. He pushed him to the ground and began to violently punch him and stomp and kick him in the head and, and, and face area. Mackenzie was declared dead shortly after. Destin and his girlfriend, Aisha Pitt, were arrested near the crash scene. Mackenzie's family is in mourning. They held each other for support just outside today's arraignment. David was the type of person who would try to walk away. He hates trouble or get himself in any kind of confrontation with anyone. So I had figured that from the moment it happened. That's what he tried to do. After the arraignment, tempers flared between the two families, with Destin's girlfriend seemingly angry. She was eventually arrested by court officers. Destin was not granted bail. These are just allegations. We're not looking to rush to any judgment. It's a wound that's going to take a very long time to heal. I assure you that. But with the help of God and friends and whoever comes to give us their support, we believe we'll overcome. Police say Destin has a record of other violent felonies, but today he was charged with DWI and murder in the second degree. We're live from Hempstead tonight. Paisy Cheng, News 4 New York.